In this video we show you how you can easily replace the battery of your Samsung Galaxy A52 on your own. Replacing the battery of the Galaxy A52 is quite difficult. Since it is strongly glued over a large surface, you will need some patience to remove it. Allow about 60 to 90 minutes for the repair. You will need the following tools to repair the Galaxy A52. Additionally, the following tools can be helpful. You can find all tools for this repair and an original Samsung replacement battery in our online store at adoc.eu. We've put the links in the info box. To avoid potential short circuits during the repair, you should turn off your Galaxy A52 first. To do so, press the side and volume down keys simultaneously for a few seconds. The A52 is opened via the heavily glued plastic back cover. In order to open it, you first have to heat the glue of the back cover. To do so, run a hot air gun or a hair dryer evenly over the edge of the back cover for a few minutes. Please note that the specified IP certification expires as soon as you're opening your phone. Once the glue is sufficiently heated, you can apply a suction cup on the back cover. Then take a flat stable tool. We can recommend the sharp edged eye flex for removing the back cover. Insert it between the back cover and the screen unit while pulling the suction cup upwards. To avoid scratching anything with the eye flex, you should then switch to a flat plastic tool like the eye plastics as soon as possible. Use the tool to drive around the back cover and detach it step by step from the screen unit. We recommend inserting flat plastic picks along the back cover edge so that the already loosened areas don't rebond. Once the back cover is completely detached, you can take it off. On the inside of the back cover, you can clearly see the adhesive frame with which the back cover was attached. The next step is to unscrew the 10 Phillips screws from the board cover. To avoid losing the small screws, we recommend using a screw storage, such as a magnetic pad. Once the screws are loosened, you can lever the cover out of the case with the help of a spudger. A notch in the cover shows you where to place your tool best. Now disconnect the battery by carefully levering its connector of the motherboard. Since small parts on the board can quickly be damaged when levering, you should always apply the tool from a free side. The next step is to remove the speaker. First, unscrew the six Phillips screws that hold it in the screen unit. Then, lever the loosened speaker out with a spudger. Again, a notch helps you to place the tool. Disconnect the cable between the USB and motherboard by carefully prying off its three connectors. Now the battery of the A52 can be removed. It is strongly glued over a large surface. To loosen it more easily, you should heat up the glue from the screen side beforehand. Then carefully lever the battery upwards with a battery spudger. Once there's a little gap, slide the plastics under the detached area and use it to separate the battery piece by piece. Work your way forward with a cutting motion. You can find an original replacement battery for your Samsung Galaxy A52 and the appropriate tools for this repair in our online store at iDoc.eu. We've put the links in the info box. 
Prepare the replacement battery by bending the battery connector if necessary and removing the protective film from its back. Put the battery back into its guide and press it firmly. To make sure it sits level, you might have to peel off larger lumps of the remaining glue from the case's bottom first. Then reattach the connection cable over the battery. Make sure the cable is aligned correctly by following the labels on the cable. Press the connectors on the USB and motherboard until you feel and hear them click into place. Be especially careful when attaching connectors and never press them down with force. A damaged connector can lead to the failure of an entire component. Put back the speaker over the USB board. There are small plastic lugs on its edge. These have to fit into the case frame so that the speaker sits level. You can then fix it with the six Phillips screws. Reconnect the battery by pressing its connector onto the motherboard. Now place the plastic cover over the motherboard. Like the speaker, it also has lugs that have to fit into the edge of the case frame. If the cover sits level, you can fix it with 10 Phillips screws. Before you glue and close the device again, you should test its functionality at this point. This way, you can be sure that your repair was successful. Connect a charging cable to see if the replacement battery charges properly. You should also check the screen's function after the repair. Use the internal Samsung test menu or our checklist to test further basic functions. We link it to you in the info box. If something does not work properly, check again if all components are connected and screwed correctly. At the end of the repair, you still have to attach the back cover. If the adhesive frame is still in good condition, you can simply reuse it. Otherwise, you should attach a new one. First, heat it up so that it is easier to remove. Then pull it off the inside of the back cover with tweezers. Align the new adhesive frame with the back cover and remove the carrier film. Then carefully press the adhesive frame along the edge. You can use a spatula for example to help you do this. If the adhesive frame fits correctly, remove the transparent protective film in the middle. Then also the green film directly above the adhesive frame. Position the back cover over the screen unit and press it firmly. To ensure that the adhesive bonds evenly everywhere, run the hot air device over the back cover once again. Afterwards, you can additionally weigh down your device for a few minutes. You've done it. The battery of your A52 is now replaced. I hope you were able to get your Samsung Galaxy A52 back to full battery power. If this tutorial helped you, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. See you next time! You can find high quality tools, spare parts and accessories for your smartphone repair in our store. iDoc. Everything for your smartphone. Click here for more helpful videos.